Hi there, Chris here with 123Muse. Let's take a look at adding a video header to this page. Now this is just a dummy page, but let's take a look at how easy it is. So we're gonna to go to our widgets and we can see the 123Muse video widgets here. We're going to drag the header onto the page, the video header, and let's just move it into place here and drag it, there we go. That's where we want it. Let's take a look at the settings. Um, we've got uh, mute, yeah, we want it muted, we want it looped. We want to show controls no, and we don't want to use cover scroll. Now, cover scroll allows the video to um, fill the browser and still allow for scrolling. So we'll take a look at that in a minute. Now, we have our system here for adding video files, either a remote URL or upload a file. We've got it currently set to remote URL so we can test the files, the video files quickly. But if we wanted to upload a file, we can just click on upload file the add file becomes available, and then we can just scan to the file that we want to upload. Okay, so let's just switch it back to a remote URL for the time being. And video, the header video image here that we have here, we've just got a background image. Let's just uh, stay with that for the time being as well. We won't load up a new one. But if you, you do need to load up one, um, and preferably the first frame of the video. So if you're using Miro to encode the video, you can choose to generate the thumbnail or just do a screen grab and um, cut it down in Photoshop just so that you've got the first um, frame of the video. And that will mean that if the video doesn't play for some reason, say it's on a device or there's some playback issue, then at least the image will show so you'll still get the look and feel of your site that you want. So let's go ahead and preview that straight away. So here we go. So we've got this nice big full screen header here and we can see that as we scale the page here the video scales with us that looks great. Let's add some content on top of that now. So I'm just going to go to my content here and just drag this into place. Let's just move that into the middle there. And that's, uh, that's all good, yep. Let's preview that now. So we can see that our content works nicely on top of the video and it instantly makes this site very dynamic and appealing and it's very easy to do. So that's how you add a video header to your View site. Now let's just take a look at cover scroll. Let's see what it does. Now you'd have to adjust the content. But let's just quickly switch it on and see how it works. So previously we had the content showing. Let's preview this in the browser this time as well. So we can see now the video actually fills up the entire screen. And as we move around, the video scales but as we scroll down we can now scroll down and see the content so obviously you'd want to change your content adjust it to allow for the fact that this is going to be um, filling the screen but it's a really good effect because you can have this high impact video and you can still scroll down the page and see the content so that's our cover scroll option on that and that in just a few minutes has shown you how to add video headers to your new site Thanks for watching.